Hi everyone, my name is Jesse and I listen to video game music for the first time. Today we're going to be re returning with Toho two versions of the same song from Toho 6 and 17.5. It is a song called UN Owen Was Her? Question mark. This one says Dolls in Pseudo Paradise. I don't know what's up with that. And apparently it's Flander Scarlet's theme. These are from the channels Unf Weeb and at Fint Third Mix. These are requested by Chrysalis, Maximilian, Solid Bullet 066, and Nikki. Right before I get started, I've seen this name a lot requested in my comments, everything Toho related, even non Toho related. I've seen this UN Owen was her a lot. So I'm guessing this is a big one. Also, just a side note, very recently, like yesterday, last night, I asked a question. I just think it's funny timing because this is not planned. This is just a platinum request. But uh, I just asked, <clears throat> um, what is some of the most popular music in gaming? I'm not taking suggestions, but, and I saw this one a couple times too. I'm like, so, you know, apparently it's a big deal. Anyways. Six and then the 17.5 version. This is UN Owen was hurt. Hmm. Okay. Not gonna lie, this one's very different amongst all the songs. It stands out. Whoa. There's like this dark energy with it. It feels different. I don't know if I've done Toho 6 before. This might be one of the earlier Toho songs I've done. That's a unique sound. That is good. Like it has that hint of Toho. But it's different. I wonder if the sound was developed for this game at this point. Damn. That, al that alone sounds... Wow. There's so much character in this. This is already probably like in my top five Toho songs already. I see, I see the vision. Sounds great too, like the quality of the sound. I don't hear the Zunpet, so that's why I asked. I'm like, was this, was that a thing yet? That's what I mean by like, have they figured out their sound by then? When I think Toho, I think strictly that.
Wow. What a jam. Love that trill in there. I love trills. Oh my god. I can't get over how sick this part is. Because you think it would just follow the past melody with a different beat, but it goes into this. Might be like my second or third favorite. Lunatic Princess is still up there, but... I can't believe I'm saying this. We still have another song. I can't believe I'm saying this. After what I just said in my last video for Toho, for Egoistic Flowers. But I can't believe I'm still hearing like new stuff in Toho. I just said how much of it sounds similar. Not in a bad way. I was praising it for it. And that's coming from someone who likes variety. Um, so it's it's broken the mold. It's past, you know, something of my own taste where I would normally be bored of it by now. But I, I like that they've figured it out. They've honed it and, you know, and owned it. Honed it and owned it. There you go. Coin it. <laughs> and, and now this, this, this... Here's what's weird about this. I've been thinking about this a lot lately. I don't do fully blind reactions. And by that I mean I know what game is coming and I know the song title before I click it. Everything else is blind. But when I mean fully blind, I mean like, here's a song, don't know anything about it, you know. But if, if this one was given to me blind, I can, I can already pretty much tell how I would react. It would be, well, this sounds like Toho, but I don't think it is. And that's like the best way I can describe this song. Um, mind you, I didn't start from the beginning. I kind of started, I don't even know which one I started at, but you know, it's been all over the place. 8, 15, 10, you know, whatever. So in my head, I think Toho, I think fast hi-hats, crazy fast piano, and it is a pit playing a, main mel a single note melody. This had the, a close sound font, to the sun pit, although I don't think it was here yet. But it had its own identity. It it doesn't sound like any Toho song I've heard so far, which is crazy to say. And I see now, well, obviously now you see why it's popular, just on that alone. But I also see why some people would even go as far as to say that it's one of the more popular songs of all time. I don't know that. Um, I, I'm, I'm doubting that. And the reason I'm saying that is because um, I, I feel like if I were to look at like a diagram, like a circle or like a, I don't know, maybe like a planet, like the core would be um, shit, I don't, I don't even know where I'm, getting, where I'm going with this, but like a popularity diagram where it's like the outer ring is songs that is known within the gaming sphere and maybe this one falls in that and then what i was referring to in my recent question which is not relevant now but is like an outer ring of like songs that everybody would know like your aunt where you stop someone in a mall and you ask them what this is now i don't know i just heard this for the first time I don't think if you stop someone on, like on the street, they would know what you and Owen was her, but maybe within that uh, inner ring of like the gaming sphere. So I feel like I heard a song that's really well known within the gaming world, if that makes any sense. Um, and I see that, I can hear that. That was sick. <laughs> and guess what, we get to hear it again. Flanders Scarlet Steam. From 
question. Do many songs stay within the series or only like the really popular ones? Do all of them get carried over and then just add new ones? There's a lot of Toho I don't know about. So why is this one in 17.5? That's what I'm asking. Okay. 17.5 UN was her. That's a crazy title too. All right, let's go. Arranged by Ziki7. All right, I think I saw somewhere that anything with 0.5 is not Zoom. Let me know if that's correct. I want to turn this up. It's kind of low on this video. Hmm. It's cool. This feels totally different. Doesn't even sound like the same song right now, so far. Okay, here we go. Ooh, that was cool. The different timing of the keyboard. Sounds like if that song was like in a haunted mansion. Sounds more like something like Electric Light Orchestra would make, you know? That sounds very yellow. <laughs> Shout out if you even know what Electric Light Orchestra is. I like the organ. Totally different. Way different. It just sounds like you've entered like a haunted house and this is the version playing of it. That's cool though. The little that the change of the timing is cool as hell. That's rare, you never hear that. There's a term for that too, and I don't know it. That's how rare it is. Let me know, music nerds. What is that? It's not changing the tempo. Hmm. Either way, sounds great. That gives me ideas as a writer. I'm like, oh yeah, I can do that too. It's just not a common first thought. Yeah, this one has the vocals too. This part reminds me of like Banjo Kazooie right here. so cool though like it's its own it sounds like its own song 
It doesn't sound like the one I just heard at all. It sounds like distant relative. But it's still cool. I don't want to take away from that. Like the like the arranger did a really good job. That's that's like a really nice song. Like it sounds like almost her own song, you know. Now, mind you, I just heard the song for the first time right before this, so I'm not like an expert on what it sounds like. But it's it sounded like totally different. Like there's you know renditions, remixes, covers, and stuff like that. And then there's you know an arrange. Obviously, is different. But that to me sounded like just a different Toho song and it had elements of you and Wasser. Let me know if I'm just crazy, but um, that was still really good though. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like that had its own ideas, its own character. It felt like its own world. That could have been a different video game. That could have been, you know, it was so, I'm kind of like praising it for its own uniqueness of it. The time changes, the kind of dun 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 dun, dun kind of reminded me of like, I guess that's something like a haunted, spooky vibe. Uh, and I'm not sure if that's what they were going for. Maybe the original character, which I'm guessing is, well, I'm guessing, as far as I know, most, if not all, the Toho songs that have been sent to me have been character themes. I could be wrong about that. So, and plus when I see a thumbnail with a character, I just assume it belongs to them. So let me know. And if that's true, then I can kind of see that. You know, this looks sort of like a haunted old painting and, you know, who knows? Who knows? But, uh, man, they were just so different. It's hard to talk about it because I thought it was just going to be pretty, pretty close. But <clears throat> I guess I said everything I had to say about the first one. I just really enjoyed it. The 17.5... Flanders Scarlet's theme. I guess the main question here, the elephant in the room, is what is this title? U N Owen was her. I'm already aware that a lot of titles in Toho are like very strange, and some have like a subtitle into the main title type of thing with the whatever that's. I forgot what that's called. If you look on your keyboard, it's right next to the one, <laughs> the squiggly line. What is it called? I forgot. But you know they have that. So. This, I remember always sticking out to me when it was requested in the comments and even my own list. You and Owen was her with the question mark. I have question marks, so. Uh, either way, that song in general was sick. I really enjoyed that. It sounded different, you know? Amongst the Toho, like in the, amongst the Toho world, that sounded very unique to me. And more of that, please. <laughs> Just because I want to see, I want to see what else Toho can bring to the table. You know, I love the stuff I've heard, but I feel like if we get into the the other stuff, if there is other stuff, I'm really curious as to what that is, because I've only had like one kind of mindset with it so far for like the past year. So. <laughs> It's always interesting how this channel works sometimes, you know, like, I think I have an idea of what's going to happen. A lot of times I still get debuts, new stuff, and then the returning games, I can't help but think, oh, okay, you know, I've heard it before. No. <laughs> so that's what's really exciting. That's what keeps it fun. And that's what somehow has kept me going. And it's always a new, fresh, cool thing. Video game music. Right? Thank you, Chrysalis, Maximilian, SolarBullet066, and Nikki for that. Uh, that was cool. Great. Let me know what's up the title and everything else I asked. Okay, thank you, Patreon members, Platinum members. Thanks you for watching. My name is Jesse in the auditorium. Later.